The Memphis Tigers are set to host the Chilean Green Wave in a highly anticipated college football showdown this week. Both teams have been performing well, making this an exciting matchup to watch. Chilean has been on a three-game winning streak, coming off a strong victory over UAB. On the offensive side, they were able to gain 448 yards and score 35 points, with quarterback Michael Pratt leading the way. Pratt threw for 184 yards and two touchdowns, while Mackay Hughes contributed 123 rushing yards and two touchdowns. The Memphis Tigers have also had a successful season so far, with four wins in their first five games. They managed to secure a tight three-point victory over Boise State, demonstrating their offensive prowess. The Tigers have averaged 36.6 points and 439 yards per game. Quarterback Seth Hennigan has been a key figure, passing for 1,376 yards and 10 touchdowns, while running back Blake Watson has added 455 rushing yards and 6 touchdowns. In this clash of two strong teams, Memphis has a slight edge. They have been performing exceptionally well on both sides of the ball, and this should help them secure a win and cover the spread. We predict a final score of 31-27 in favor of the Memphis Tigers. Don't miss this exciting game as both teams battle it out for victory. Enjoy the action. The Fresno State Bulldogs are set to continue their road trip this week as they face Utah State in Logan, Utah. Fresno State has had a remarkable season, with five wins in their first six games. They suffered a narrow five-point loss to Wyoming in their last outing. Quarterback Mike Keane has been leading the Bulldogs' offense this season, amassing 1,692 yards and 15 touchdowns on 159 completions. In their recent game against Wyoming, Mike Keane put up a strong performance, completing 23 passes for 218 yards and one touchdown. Logan Five contributed seven completions for 68 yards and one touchdown. On the ground, Malik Sherrod rushed for 48 yards on 11 carries, and Jalen Moss led the team with 115 yards and one touchdown. Mac Daniel was a top receiver with 1,590 yards and one touchdown on eight receptions. On the other side, the Utah State Aggies will be playing at home with a 3-3 record for the season. They are on a two-game winning streak after a convincing 20-point victory over Colorado State. While their defense gave up 24 points on 320 total yards in the last game, they were strong in forcing turnovers and limiting third-down conversions. Offensively, the Aggies scored 44 points, including 27 in the second half, with 639 total yards. Cooper Leggers leads the Utah State defense this season with 975 yards and 10 touchdowns on 78 completions. Davon Booth has been a key running back with 395 yards and 4 touchdowns on 62 carries. Their receiving core is led by Jalen Royals with 522 yards and 7 touchdowns on 32 catches and Tara Vaughn with 490 yards and 7 touchdowns on 46 catches. In this matchup, the Fresno State Bulldogs appear to be the stronger team. They will be looking for one to bounce back from their recent loss and continue their successful season. We predict a final score of 38-7 in favor of the Fresno State Bulldogs. Don't miss this game as both teams compete for victory. Enjoy the action. The Stafford Cardinal will be on the road this week, heading to Boulder, Colorado to face the Colorado Buffaloes. Stafford is currently three games below, 500 on the year and is on a four-game losing streak, including a 26-point blowout loss to Oregon a few weeks ago. The Cardinal have struggled on both sides of the ball this season. Offensively, they are averaging just 19.2 points per game on 344.4 yards, while their defense ranks as one of the lower-performing units in the conference allowing 34.6 points on 445.2 yards per game. Quarterback Ashton Daniels leads the Stanford offense this season, having thrown for 561 yards and three touchdowns on 48 completions. In the rushing game, Casey Filkins is the top performer with 197 yards and one touchdown on 31 carries. Additionally, three other Stanford running backs have combined for 377 yards and one touchdown each on 104 total carries. Benjamin Uosik leads the receiving core with 227 yards and one touchdown on 15 receptions. The Colorado Buffaloes are returning home this week, sporting a record that is two games above 500. They are coming off a three-point victory against Arizona State, ending a two-game skid. In that game, 
the Buffaloes allowed 24 points on 392 total offensive yards but limited third down conversions, and their offense outperformed the Sun Devils. Jadur Sanders was the architect behind the Colorado scoring, completing 26 passes for 239 yards and one touchdown. Anthony Hankerson led the rushing game with 58 yards on 10 carries. The top receiver for Colorado was Javon Antonio, who gained 81 yards and scored one touchdown on five receptions, while Jimmy Horn Jr. added 49 yards on five catches. This week, the Colorado Buffaloes are the stronger team, and it's expected to be evident right from the beginning of the game. Colorado is poised to dominate this matchup on both sides of the ball, especially against the struggling Stanford team. Expect the Buffaloes to extend their winning streak with a convincing win and cover at home. The final score prediction is a 42-10 victory for the Colorado Buffaloes. Don't miss this game as Colorado looks to continue their successful season.